What are we talking about again? Oh. Girl of Growing black. Up black. Okay. Yeah. Oh my god. Where do you start? Where do you start? Around how? We can talk about the classics. Uh, opens. Uh, Mama ain't gonna listen. Growing up black is like, is like, is like having everything in front of you and not being allowed to touch it. Growing up black is like being in the most fun prison in the world. You can do stuff. But if they don't like it, you gon' get it. Now, I don't know if there's white people watching this, but all the black kids heard me say you won't get it and they were like, Oh my god, he knows me. I don't know you dude, I got it too. Like if mama see this, mom don't pretend you went in the kitchen hitting me with that wooden spoon twice, I didn't deserve it. And then I tried to talk to you about it, you ignored me. Yeah, I got you, I told the world on you. Now the whole world know what type of mama you are. You don't whoop me for no reason. Black mamas do this thing where they get tired of not whooping you and they whoop you. I was 12, I remember. Think about like, you know how America shows Disney World on TV? Yeah, you standing at the gate. <laughs> It looks fine where, where you wanna be, but you're never gonna go in because your mama <laughs> gonna tell you we didn't we don't have the money this month and next month and the month. Yeah, yeah. You owe me a bicycle, lady. Yeah, I ain't get my bicycle. She done she done showed me the bicycle. Y'all y'all pretending this is a joke. She showed me the bicycle and she didn't give it to me. She was like, there's the bicycle. I was like, yeah. She was like, next month. We all know next month it means, it means nigga keep annoying me. And you know that's the worst thing with black parents? They say they're gonna do something. Remind them enough times they're gonna pretend. The script didn't happen, like like they didn't say they're gonna do the thing that you're complaining about. <laughs> yeah, boy. Spusiso, shout out to you too, because Spusiso is a black dad. Don't pretend you're not in the house annoying the crap out of all the kids. Yeah, Spusiso, that dad who got his own chair. This nigga see you comfortable, you could be sleeping. Spusiso would come there, watch TV for five minutes, move you off the chair, sit there for five minutes, and then go. That's Spusiso. So, like, it's not only black moms, I don't want my mom to feel like it's just, no, it's not you. It's the community. And that aunt, we're not gonna pretend you didn't feed me soap when I was two years old for calling my sister stupid. She was being stupid. I didn't lie. I didn't lie. I called her stupid. You fed me soap. You made me wash my teeth with soap. <laughs> like, we didn't have Colgate in the other room. But, like, look, I still want the money, though. Like, let's, let's not get this twisted. Yeah, and mom, why did we get colorful cereal when I was a kid? All the white kids had them Cheerios and who's 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 who's. I got that no name brand. Mm -hmm. I'm a tell them. Cheerios are brown though. Yeah, nigga, yeah. nigga, wait yeah. a minute, goddammit. Whose team are you on? Some of the things weren't normal, but like your mind makes it normal because it, it happens every week, you know. She, she hit you. She knows she hit you for no reason. She gonna look at you like you said something wrong after saying, but. Mommy, it wasn't me. And then she, she'll never say sorry. Black parents don't know that word. Nigga, apology? You deserve an apology, like you're not a black child. You know you're black. Nigga, get out of here. I want my mom to say sorry. What? I think your mom is Samantha, ne? You forgetting Spongulus has got that risk, boy. I'm talking about that Steph Curry. Mm, three shots on the body. Mm, mm, mm. In the hood, we all had the same alarm clock for going into the house, right? Like, and like when the street lights are on and you're still outside, woo! Thing is, you don't know if you should rush home or like you should be even more like. It's, it's the saddest thing because like you're not that late but you're gonna get that i'm late whooping whoopings don't discriminate like the street lights went on right and i was sitting there kicking the ball like i usually do star player vibes not that comedy i'm talking cr7 Woo! my grandma called squad dog she had my other two grandmas sitting in the living room i'm thinking look man they're about to have a meeting about their problems no no they had come together for me but they didn't tell me so I walked through the door, my grandma behind me, she closed the door, she locked it. I'm like... Then I'm like, nah dog, you're just being paranoid. I went into the living room, right? I go sit down, my two grandmas standing there, I'm like, hey, hey. And then they both give me the look and they're like, mm-hmm. I was like, oh shit, it's about to go down. And I didn't think too much because like the TV was on and they were watching it. So like, I try to watch the TV, then my grand does the slyest things you've ever seen. She stands up, right? Pretend she's about to go get a glass of water because she asked me if I also want water. I was like, mm, I could drink. And then I don't know it, she like walks by. Then as she walks by, like she takes one step past me, then she comes back with like the hottest backhand of my life. And now I'm dazed. Like I can't even, I can't even duck anymore because like I'm like, Tch. Oh my god, she just hit me. And then like she gave me like 22 to follow. Like she had the snaps for years. I, I only realized I'm being snapped like at the 16th one. But like growing up black, let's not make it sound like it was all terrible. Hey, that's a bullshit. <laughs> Fuck it was. 
um but but bonuses um you get stories and i don't even know why they put those plates in the house that you can't touch why people don't have those plates hmm? why why do we have to have tupperware in the section yeah why is the tupperware in a specific section and why can i never use it i don't have a lunchbox for school because you bought that checkers one and then for you you got the tupperware and then you got the fancy glasses that only come out never i think all black kids need a day for ourselves like us who grew up in the old school not these new school black kids these these red bastards get away with anything i, I heard this nigga i swear at his mama and he had the look of i'm not gonna have any consequences i was like ha ah. if i saw it my mom my ancestors would have gotten up and came to the house and sat down just to watch the whooping i just need you to know like it was gonna be the biggest event in my household if i saw it mama this little nigga in the shop just like mom i said i wanna fucking ooh. i had flashbacks is what i'm trying to say i was like no no don't do it don't do it spirit spirit out there yeah what you gonna do his mama I need to meet that lady. She need a whooping too. It's a recession of whoopings. I mean, the hood's still holding it down though. Like, you know, shout out to KG, Soero, parts of Pretoria, you know, Alex, Alex, Alex. Thing is, in Alex, they worry more about the rest than the whoopings. Like, you, you gotta come together as a unit. Like, y'all you, gotta fight them rats. I grew up black as shit. Y'all need to know this. I'm, I'm black. I'm out. S subscribe. Like comment <laughs> like. let me break it down for you it's what's on the inside that counts what looks good isn't